Hello, my name is Jordan Davis again. Thank you for clicking on this video and welcome back to my channel. Y'all, we have entered the top five for our Eurovision 2011 top 15 week. And I am super excited to get to this reaction because this is one that I've been waiting to do. So we are reacting to fourth place and fourth place at Eurovision 2011 was the country Ukraine with the song Angel by Mika Newton. Now I knew this is one of the earlier 2011 songs I ever heard. I don't know why. Maybe it was because the sand artist made me want to look it up. I can't remember why this was like one of the earliest. But regardless, I saw it somewhere and I looked this up, you know, a couple of years ago when I first watched 2011. And I have really enjoyed the song ever since, especially because for me, this is one of the most underrated Ukrainian entries of the past, you know, 10 years. And I'm saying that without having thought through each one diligently, but in my mind, this one doesn't get as much love as a lot of other Ukrainian entries, but in my mind, it's as good as a lot of other ones. Um, so super excited to get into this, to listen to this. Like I said, I have the 2011 album, but the sad thing is this song on the album, there must have been a scratch on the CD. Like I have the physical album. And so there must have been a scratch on the CD because every time it gets through this song, there's one point where it's like, and then sometimes it goes on and sometimes it doesn't. So like, it'll be nice to be able to watch, listen to the whole thing, let alone watch the video too. So let's go ahead and get into this. I like that name too, Mika. That's a pretty name. They really let this heartbeat go on for a minute, don't they? <laughs> I was like, Germany, stop it. <laughs> this is another song with a, such a recognizable introduction. When you look into my eyes, world becomes a better place. Isn't this the same lady that was in Moldova 2019? The same artist? I like her dress. Baby, I love you and you. We are burning the place so high, and we are falling down. I like the little shoulder things. I don't know. They're different, but I like them. Her voice just cuts right through. I always thought she said crystallize until I looked it up. <laughs> I love the melody of this chorus though. When you look into my eyes, it will never hit to stop. Baby, I love you. And let's not even pretend like we don't know how cool that singing artist is. Like, that's a beautiful couple of lines. Just one other example of how great Ukrainian singers are. <laughs> Listen, mm. and I love the fog on the stage. Just amps up the mystery. Sing it, girl. Ooh. I love this chorus. Look how high her voice sits. And she has a high voice. But she's still powerful. Oh, I love this thing with the birds. I just 
listen to that. She's singing a cappella. She sang it for like nine seconds and it did not waver from the note, okay? If that doesn't convince you that Mika is a great vocalist, I don't know what will. Um, but I, what is Mika doing these days? Because I might like to look up some more of her music. So I think, okay, I have to admit, if there's one thing I don't talk about enough on my channel, and this is me calling myself out, it's like lyrics, because sometimes it's hard to listen to the lyrics when you're um, trying to analyze, you know, the, the vocals and the dancing and the staging, so sometimes you miss the lyrics. But because I already know this song pretty well, I just have to say that these lyrics really, I really enjoy them. And I know they're not the most complex lyrics in the chorus, and I'm talking about in the chorus especially, but that whole, we are birds that fly so high and we're falling down, like that's a beautiful idea to me, it's a beautiful um, metaphor to me. Um, when I dream of you, my dream is so fearless. Like, again, it's not the most complex lyric, but there's something touching about it. Um, we're people of the planet, we live human lives, we are angels, we are in danger, we are crystal white. Like, I love that line too, we are crystal white. I don't know, just something about that chorus is so beautiful to me, and I think it's also reflected by a really beautiful melody. Um, because I love the melody of this chorus and it's so memorable to me, like, I, I could sing this for you at any given time of any given day if you asked me to. Like, it sticks in my head that much. Um, and at the same time, like I said, the very beginning of this song, just with that weird, like, technological sounding introduction is so recognizable that, like, anytime this song comes on my phone, I'm like, wait, is this, is this making them an angel? So... <laughs> I liked the styling, I liked her dress actually. I know it was a little bit out there, but I liked her shoulder things as well. And of course we liked the sand artist too. I think I focused on the sand artist more when I first watched this performance. And now that I've seen it multiple, multiple times, I think now I am shifting my focus, I've shifted my focus a little bit more to her as the singer. And so maybe that is a bad thing or maybe that's a good thing, but I think that's just something I notice now is I watch her a lot more as the singer and the sand artist a little bit less. And maybe that's also because I'm doing a reaction video and so I wanted to focus on her. But anyway, I have noticed that as I watch this performance more. So anyway, I've really enjoyed that. I've really been waiting to do that. And I can't wait to do the top three entries tomorrow. So be on the lookout for those. Those videos will come out on Friday. So anyway, let me know what you think about this. Was this one of your favorite, one of your least favorite, one of your middle Ukrainian entries? What about your 2011 entries? How does it place among those? Um, like this video if you like this video, comment below like I said, and then please consider subscribing if you haven't. But anyway, thanks for clicking on this video, thanks for watching this video, and as always, I will see you next time.